Hey guys, this is Rodin here, and uh, in this video I'll just show you guys a nice website where you can find mods, and uh, also I'm going to show you a website where you can find auto installers, so yeah, I'm, I, know, I know I made a video on how to install the other, but this website does actually have a auto installer for it, for it. so it's http um, slash, or I mean it's a column slash slash skydash with set, not, not s, so yeah, dot com. And when you get there, um, well, skydos.com, then uh, you can see all of this mods, Minecraft tools, maps, Minecraft, Skydos installers. So you want to click Skydos installers. And uh, when you get there, you can see a lot of mods. Um, it's really awesome. that This is the Aether mod installer for Minecraft. Power up, Powercraft mod, or whatever, baby animals. Yeah, you know, guns, mod. And there's a lot of webs, uh, I mean, uh, older entries, which is for 1.0. But yeah, you just click here to see more. This is not all. This is not all you can find here. So I haven't actually checked the mods here, but uh, doesn't seem to be much. I think I've checked this, but it, this seems to only be three. So what you want to do to find mods, you want to go to minecraftdl.com, and here you can find a lot of mods, texture packs, and uh, last but not least, um, adventure maps. <coughs> I think. So when you get here. Uh, Minecraft, Minecraft mods, Minecraft skins, uh, Minecraft texture packs, Minecraft maps. So if you click Minecraft mods, you'll obviously go to the mod section, and there's also a lot of. Um, it seems to be a lot of uh, mods, pa mod packs, whatever. And yeah, water shader, Minecraft, top ten Minecraft mods, whatever. And there's a lot of pages of this, so you can find 1.8 mods too if you're looking for that. And uh, also we have the texture packs, and uh, yeah. It has a lot of texture packs here, as you can see. Um, so I, I think it's quite convenient because then you don't have to go to the forums and just open uh, pages without even knowing what it looks like. But here you can see the pictures of them. So, for example, we go to the next side, you can see more texture packs, of course. And my internet is really slow. Um, smooth vanilla texture packs, as you can see here. Uh, I don't know if you can see that well, but you know. And yeah, that's a cookie from Shrek. <laughs> cookie man, whatever. Gingerbread man. Um, yeah, and we also have the maps here. Um, I haven't checked too much of that, but it is cool, I guess. <laughs> yeah, it it just shows you a little bit of the map, or like a picture like this, for example. Forgotten Temple. Uh, yeah, uh, it's quite convenient, and uh, hopefully you guys uh, found this useful, because I just helped some guy here, or girl, I don't know, actually. Cole, yeah, I'm guessing that's a girl. I'm not, I'm not sure, I'm sorry if you're, if you're a dude. But uh, I don't know where she is, but or he is. I, I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry. But yeah, uh, I helped her install the Aether mod just by sending her the link. So it's that easy. It's that easy to install. So all of you guys that actually watched my Aether mod thing, don't worry. Just go to that page, skydash.com, and you just need a clean Minecraft. And by the way, if you guys don't know how to uh, how to get a clean Minecraft, you just open your Minecraft thing and then. Um, I don't have the normal launcher, but but uh, it should be a force update button, button somewhere, and uh, yeah, it helps. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and uh, yeah, if you want me to show how to install uh, some mods, just leave the names of them, and I'll do that, and uh, give props to you guys, or shout out whatever you want. <laughs> but other than that, I hope you enjoyed, and uh, be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.